Huh. What the shit? Oh, it's, there's a light up there. Okay. We'll explore this part first, and we'll go down the other path later. Going up. I go up as the frames go down. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my god. Have I mentioned that this playthrough needs to be finished up sooner rather than later? <laughs> Chainsaw just murdered it. Okay. 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 Oh my god. Uh. What, <laughs> what happened? We've entered the skybox. No, we've entered the map. He can't leave. He can't go down. Shit. Shit. Uh. Oh, it can't end like this. You just got the chainsaw. Oh no. Oh lordy. Oh, oh, oh. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. What is going on? Crouch, you fool. Crouch. Oh. Oh. We're free! <laughs> and thankfully we're still alive. Oh hey, there's a campfire. <laughs> Light it for good luck. Uh, is there anything we should cook? I mean, we got people, but I don't know if we want to cook people. Yeah. Alright, back to climbing. This time, don't enter our head into the fucking ceiling. <laughs> Be really careful this time. Good old indie games, man. <laughs> I mean, this game is absurdly high quality for an indie game, but it's still an indie game. <laughs> now, here's a question. Here's a question that will make a big difference as to how good this chainsaw is. Is this the kind of game where the chainsaw, when you activate it, the guy just swings it? Or does he just hold it in front of him? Because if I can do actual chainsaw combos, then that's great. If I can't, then that's a pain in the ass. So many campfires down here. Somebody has been here before me. Just casual light. Yeah, and apparently they've been busy hanging up corpses. Yeah. Right, let's use a flashlight so I can... Alright. Now that's a spooky perspective. I'm coming for you. Who do you think anything's down there? Let's get out of the map here. Take a look. Yeah, it looks like this is a dead end. It's probably worth a good look, though. Oh, don't. <laughs> go, in, <laughs> go in with a chainsaw. Attack the water. It never saw it come. No, 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 no. Put the chainsaw behind you and run the chainsaw to pick up speed. <laughs> You're cold and wet. Build a fire to get dry. Oh, man. <sighs> more of these deep sea adventures. For this game to be called The Forest, I've spent more fucking time with water than I have with any trees. Yeah. Like, either we're... Oh, my God. Either we're rafting or we're swimming. If we were... Yeah. Okay, time to time for us to see if there's any options to just fucking lower the. <laughs> Let's make it look shittier, shall we? Oh yes. Oh no. Okay. I've... Now let's just make the game look like mud. Now now that's the fun of the series. How hideous can we make this game that it's <laughs> it's beautiful at ultra high quality? Let's just turn it into something horrible. This is part of the lore. The longer he's on the island, the more insane he gets, and that's why everything becomes distorted. Yeah, that or he's getting old and he needs glasses. Oh yeah, that too. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, well, I'm getting stuck. It looks like a lawn chair. We're trying to make something out of nothing lately with this with this playthrough. <laughs> Can I pull the map out underwater? Because I can't figure out where the fuck I'm going. 
get it wet. That would be good. Well, we did a complete circle because I think that's just a dead end. Uh, I'm thinking the same thing. Yep, yeah, it is. Well, let's take a look at the map here. Well, the textures applied to the map. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what am I dying from? We're freezing. Oh, well, that makes sense, doesn't it? Uh, you know, for as long as we've been underwater, I'm impressed all that dried meat is still dry. No, don't. Hang on, build a fire. Yep, we are freezing to death. Hey, we're warm again. Oh man, this game is this game. I'm not gonna lie, full of a lot of pain in the ass mechanics. <laughs> All right, we're good. I have not get to, gotten to use this chainsaw on anyone yet. How disappointing! And I've got I'm like full up on gas tanks for it too. So. Huh. Oh! Fucking bats! <laughs> Alright, let's use the flashlight so I don't scare the crap out of my ass. Oh, yeah, that's an exit. Oh my god, look! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. All right, so this nice is where we are. Campsite out here. Yeah, headed back in. All right, well, let's. I guess there is nothing here. Can the map help us? Fuck no, it can't. <laughs> let's turn up to at least half resolution on textures. Oh no, not full resolution though. If we ever get around to doing a couchless co-op of a PC game again, we're going to have to choose a better game than this. <laughs> Same fucking bats! Yeah, they're back for vengeance. Uh. Well, yeah. Not a whole lot going on here. There is another, uh, there is a little passageway we didn't explore, which, uh, we'll go hit that. Nice. Pull out our chainsaw for safety. Ah, I need the climbing axe. <laughs> Every time I get scared in this game, a little bit more of my spirit dies. <laughs> like, it's a, it's a pity it was, it's still not accepting you to, it's still not allowing you to hear the noise. Because you, then you'd understand why the bat sound is, is getting me so badly. Uh, we've not explored this part, I think. Right. Oh, I'm too tall. Too <laughs> tall. Oh, Jesus, it's underwater. <laughs> Fucking... Welcome back to Alex and Pink's swimming extravaganza. <laughs> swimming Simulator 2018. You're cold and wet. Fuck me. <laughs> Person has been cold and wet more than he's ever been nice and warm. What a travesty. Alright, wonderful. There's nothing fucking down here. <laughs> Bamboozled again. Alright, well... I suppose we'll go warm ourselves back up and continue to explore the infinite fucking cave. Turn on your light. There we go. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna have to go light that fire back up so we can warm our ass back up, because this guy's too picky. Uh, I'm getting angry at this guy, but he's suffering from, like, hypothermia. 
<laughs> probably got several. In fact, he's probably he's definitely got AIDS at this point. As much blood he has spilled onto himself. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it, is that a new thing we're gonna say about this guy? He murders AIDS victims. <laughs> Added to the list. <laughs> is this sad to say? That's still not the worst. <laughs> Well, he kills the AIDS victims. At least he isn't eating them yet. This is true. Alright, well, that went fucking nowhere. Well, it, it... Wait. Was this the part where we go back to where... No, this is definitely not the part I was thinking of. Give this time... Guess, give this guy some time to let his forearms relax. <laughs> Christ alive. Phew. Okay, turn the floor. Here's a pain in the ass thing. Because the chainsaw is technically considered a two-handed weapon, every time he gets it out, he puts away the flashlight, so I have to get him to pick the flashlight back up. <laughs> Alright, well, we got the chainsaw out of this and nothing else. There's this little dining room here. Uh, this is where we got the uh, chainsaw. Oh, yeah. I thought for sure this would be a boss arena, but hey. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's jack shit down here. Aside from the chainsaw. Yeah. Which, I mean, far far be it from me to bitch about the chainsaw, but... Yeah. I don't know if we're lucky or an unfortunate. Oh, uh, we'll be fortunate. We'll be fortunate very soon. I think the only issue is we still don't have any armor, but this is this has to make be a good weapon, right? This has to be the best weapon in the game, right? It's you a, would think. It's a fucking chainsaw. It's a freaking chainsaw. It's a melee weapon that requires ammo. From so even from a gameplay perspective, it's like this has to be worth the investment. Because there is a little gas me meter at the bottom, so right. we're, we're going to need to refill it. It is curious that he's not running out the gas right now, though, because he's got the thing running. He just isn't using it. <laughs> just ain't pulling the trigger. Can I just say, like, chainsaws have had such a place in fiction. I get terrified any time I see someone using a chainsaw in real life. <laughs> and not because I think I think uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Not because I think they're going to use it on me. What gets me more so... Oh, save point. <laughs> I forgot I left this here. Yeah. What gets me more so is, I always get worried, you know, what if someone slips and falls on the chainsaw, you know? Yeah. Because that would be a bad fucking way to go. <laughs> no doubt. Light, dumbass. Okay, where am I? Okay. Got turned all around. Now, there are several sections, according to the map, that we haven't explored this cave, unfortunately. Yes. <laughs> The cave has no end. Only the people have ends. Yeah. There's the tagline for the series. <laughs> oh, there I missed another bullet. Huh. How well, did that happen? Oh, turn. Yeah, all right, there we go. It said it can't carry more skulls, but I thought it said snails, and I was confused for a second. Snails would be a pretty good Snails are supposed to be good, right? Don't the French eat them all the time? I know oh. it, I know it's a stereotype. Definitely. It could definitely aid in our survival. Yeah. Where are you supposed to fucking find snails? Mm, they, w they wouldn't be in caves. They'd be in, like, leaf litter and whatnot. Ah. Uh, Decaying wood. I've never... I don't think I've ever seen a uh, wild snail in my life. I've only seen domestic snails. <laughs> That's funny. I remember always wanting to have one, because, uh... Because, you know, I was a little kid and Spongebob was big on television at the time. Mm. And when we went to get one, instead we got, uh, hermit crabs. Because apparently hermit crab, like, my parents were trying to be economical about it. And apparently uh. hermit crabs actually clean up the area where s snails fuck it up because they leave slime everywhere, you know? Oh, yeah. So, we got two hermit crabs. 
and we found out something very interesting about hermit crabs. You can't have two hermit crabs, or at least you can't put them in the same enclosure, because no, at some cannot. at some point, one of them will murder the other to steal their shell. Yes. Hermit Whoopsie. crabs are not good pets at all. Ha! <laughs> if only we'd have known that before. <laughs> yeah. Also, I'm sure many many people have made such mistakes. Hang on. Does the map say we can go here? No, it doesn't. Can I still get... I, the name there, though, there's supposed to be a name for this cave. And it's not completed yet, because I haven't explored that area. No. Okay. I have completed the cave text as, mo as much as I think I'm going to be able to. Why the fucking waterfalls all over this place? Oh, Jesus. I thought we were about to die there. Ha! <laughs> No, oh, good thing there's a save point not too far, huh? <laughs> Alright, well... I don't know where else there is to go. Evidently, this area has some stuff we haven't explored, but I could have swore we've already been there, right? Right. Yeah. Also, my guy's thirsty. Should probably slam down a soda. Soda and candy bars. This guy... The ultimate survivalist diet. <laughs> Have we already been here? Is that, that's where we came from, right? Yeah, we entered this way, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I... Okay, we still need to go, though, because apparently there's another pathway we didn't check anyway, so... Fuck. How's the flashlight doing? 16% battery. That's not great, but we'll use up a little bit of that. Alright. Let's go ahead and get a fucking move on. Cause we Up got the rope. We do have the chainsaw. And uh the internet has told me that evidently the other item I was the other weapon I was looking for that Mike enlightened me to the presence of is also located somewhere in this cave system. Ah. So we aren't done yet until we get that. Help me, map. Where are we supposed to go? <laughs> Show us the way. I like how this guy is able to fill it in, like, oh, nope, I've not explored this part yet. <laughs> like, he knows there's extra parts he didn't see. It's just superpower, I guess. <laughs> Those survival instincts at work. Oh, we're back at the ledge. Oh, no. Oh, frames. Yeah. There we go. Huh. See, oh, fuck, you went back to the overworld map. Huh. Well, I can at least get a good look into the sinkhole. Is it? Hang on. You see that? At the bottom of the sinkhole there. Looks like a fucking helicopter. Are you kidding me? All kinds of shit has crashed on this island. What? What is going on? Is there like some magical aura around this place? Like that, uh, that TV series, uh, Lost? I always get that show confused with Survivor, which no doubt pisses off the fans if they're watching. But hey, I don't care. Oh, bones. I was cooking bones. That's cool. Let's go ahead and light this fire. Uh, do I have any other people to cook? I don't think so. <laughs> uh. Questions asked regularly here. Uh, well, it doesn't look like... Yeah, the, there is another entrance that Mike showed me that... Uh, or he, he gave me a picture of it, which is, you know, about as helpful as you can imagine. <laughs> Here's a hole in the ground. Go fucking find it, nerd. <laughs> but you didn't get to see it. But there's, it looks like there's a crashed helicopter in the sinkhole. Oh. Ah. So there like must be some kind of aura around the island causes shit to crash. I told you, Bermuda Triangle. 
It w evidently, we're somewhere in the Bermuda Triangle, but my thing is, like, if if shit crashes here regularly, would, wouldn't would Air Control, like, try to not have shit land here? Yeah, you would think. They're kind of dumb, though. Yeah, I guess. I've never ridden an air rode an airplane, but I've heard stories. <laughs> All right. Oh well, we can save here again. If we really want to. Guess it never hurts to. I guess there's no such thing as saving too often. All right. It's getting kind of dark outside, so I we'll probably just. Uh, we. I wish the wristwatches worked. I wish I wish they did so that we could understand what time it is when we're on, in a cave. Yeah, that'd be... Spectacular, I believe, is the appropriate word. Yeah, fuck it, we'll give it a shot. Alright, we're not dead. I genuinely get worried every time that our character sleeps in the wild that you'll just get a cutscene of your character being murdered in his sleep. Alright, is it nighttime or daytime? Alright, it's morning time. We actually timed that correctly. Wondrous. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and get to the surface and then we're gonna probably look for the last cave. Hang on, let's go ahead and eat this last dried meat. Nope, eat it. Don't don't use it. Eat it. And slam down another soda. Now the torches. Yeah, just about bad, out of batteries. Oh, yeah, torch plus slingshot. That's great. It's exactly what I meant to do. Fucking thing. All right. Well, we're gonna have to head up back up to the surface here. Yeah. I think there might be some issues on my side that are giving Pink some trouble. Yeah, I'm back now. Yeah, uh, I see you uh, keep trying to leave and come back to see if it fixes it. I think it's on my side. Ah. Because I think right now we're having stretches of the thing. The thing is bugging out because it doesn't like to do this and OBS and Discord at the same time. Which I think this may be the last time we try... It's giving so much trouble, I think this may be the last time we use this setup. Because after this, we are absolutely trying out another fucking setup. Because this is this shit's not working. Let's get back up the rope, and what we're going to do is we're going to look around the lake area, apparently, that's above the sinkhole. Because Mike says that's where we want to look for my next big item. So, after that, though, there should be one last... Oh, oh, oh no, okay. Oh no. <laughs> Good fucking lord, this is, this is just, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Alright, but anyways, after we get this last item, we're probably going to wrap up this session so that we can, so that at least we can experiment with alternative possibilities. I don't know how you open you are to the possibility, but yeah, that should be good. Yeah, and at, when we come back after that that cave exploration, there should be one last cave. Mike has mentioned to me that we'll have one last vital plot item, and then we should hit the sinkhole. Nice. Just keep climbing. Just keep climbing. Just keep climbing. Fuck me. <laughs> All right, now wait for a little bit because the guy's got a the guy's tired now. <laughs> We're so close to the end, man. Push through. How does he? How does he catch his breath while he's holding onto the rope like this? This seems odd. Yeah, <laughs> very odd. I'm just gonna hang, gather my bear. All right, well, now that we've got the chainsaw out, I am no longer scared of running into cannibals in the woods. <laughs> the big creepy... <laughs> Must fear us. The creepy monsters could still be a threat, though. Also, hey, did you like my new art, uh, modern art piece? Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, this one's actually Look mine. Yeah. <laughs> I did that, not the cannibals. <laughs>